Hey Cougars! Welcome back to Cougar News. My name is Caitlin. And my name is Susana. The student store has everything you need. Mikey finds out more. Hey Cougars, today we're going to be asking questions about the student store. Hello, we wanted to stop by to ask a couple of questions about the student store, like what do you guys sell here? Alright, so well some of the things we sell is Cougar wear, such as sweaters, shirts, and even beanies. We're actually wearing some of that Cougar wear right now. Okay, okay. Nice, drippy. Is that all you guys sell here? No, we also s we're also selling new merchandise such as a hydro flask right here, okay. a little drawstring bag right there. Oh. Yeah, and we also have a very limited cougar stuffed animal right there. How much is that? The, oh, how much it is? How much is that? Yeah, how much yeah. is that? We, uh, from the person in the back right there, it's fifteen dollars. They're very limited right now. Okay. Yeah, very limited. I think we have like forty-five. And we also have one one little cougar back here who who's going to school every day. She's she's constantly changing her clothes. Nice. Every day, cause, you know, she, she gotta look. Look good for school. Look good for school. Exactly. So what's the purpose of the student store? Um, so we sell tickets here for um, school events. We also, um, this is a place where you can create a club. Um, and we do financial paperwork for the clubs. And this is also a place where you can find spirit wear or year, uh, past yearbooks, um, where you can get your academic letters. Um, and also this is where you can uh, get your first five their five-star students um, awards here. Okay. Thank you. Hey Cougars, I'm Mikey. Make sure to come get your new merchandise at the student store. Our varsity soccer beat Apple 4-2 this past Tuesday. Mario checks in with the boys to see how they're doing. Uh, hey, what's up everyone? My name is Mario and we're out here in the soccer game against Apple Valley and right here we have Nate, uh, which is a sophomore. And Nate, I want to tell you uh, a few questions if that's okay for you. Yeah, I'm alright with that. Okay, so how do you feel about being D1? Feels good. We accomplished a lot last year, and we're here to do more. For this season, how, how far do you think you'll go? The plan is to go all the championship and win it. But we'll see. Cool, cool, cool. All right, and uh, uh, last question. Um, how long have you been playing soccer for? I've been playing soccer for like 13 years. 13 years. That's nice. Okay, so we have Eric right here. He's a senior for uh, Granite Hills. Um, Eric, how does it feel to be uh, D1? It feels good. I feel like we uh, we earned it. We worked hard all these past years, and uh, I feel like uh, we deserve to be here. Cool, cool. Um, for how far do you think you'll make it in preseason? Um, I feel like we're gonna go undefeated and win CIF and get the ring season this year. Cool. And how long have you been playing soccer for? Um, I don't know. Since I was little, it's been a minute. Coach Caceres, I have a question for you. Um, I wanted to ask, uh, what's the tradition here with uh, Granite Hills uh, soccer? You know, we created a uh, soccer atmosphere here. Um, I've been here since they opened, so this is my 23rd year. And um, the tradition is uh, we, we, we just, um, soccer is, is Granite Hills here. And we, we are one of the top teams in the desert. And every year, people fear us. <laughs> How do you feel about the boys for this year's uh, soccer team for 2022 to 2023? Well, it, it's it's gonna it's gonna be some work. Um, we still have a lot of work to do. Um, we've always been very very solid. We always build from the back to the front. So this year we're rebuilding our our goalie and our defense. So we're you know we're gonna struggle at times, but we have a lot of quality returners in the attacking and then attacking third and some. Um, uh, somewhat experienced younger guys that um, could step up in the position so it's gonna um, <clears throat> I look forward to the season it's gonna be very challenging since we're division one but um, at the other end I'm, I'm excited to um, you know build something that we really have never had to worry about um, you know in our def defensive back how does it feel to be d1 uh, it feels good man it feels good to be d1 but we just got to work hard and be d1 level good 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 and how far do you think you'll make it a preseason? I think we'll do pr good in preseason. I think we'll be undefeated. That's nice. And uh, I heard you're pretty good at the field. Um, uh, how, how many how many years have you played uh, soccer for? Uh, I've been playing soccer since I was four, so that makes 13 years. All right, Caesar. Thank you very much. All right, I appreciate it. Thank you, Mario. Well, Susana, looks like that's all we got for this week. It appears so, Caitlin. We will catch up with you guys next week and update you on what's going on around our beloved world of Granite Hills High School. For now, Cougars, I'm Susana. And I'm Caitlin. And remember, Cougars, maroon and gray lead the way. way.